Okay, this video is in response to this comment right here. And the continuation of that comment is here. All right, I appreciate you definitely respond, uh, responding to my video and I'm glad that you have had a chance to listen to the video because it means a lot, for real. Like what, when I make these videos, I like, I, I, I know it's, to me, it just seems like I'm talking to a phone, a camera, whatever. But on the other side of that, there's someone listening that may receive something from your message that you projected or whatever. So I, I definitely want to encourage anybody, period, to go out there and, and make videos, whether it be on YouTube, TikTok, whatever you want to use, use your platform to be, you should make videos. And this, what inspired me to even do this right here, because before th this channel was like just sitting here, bro. Like I just, I posted random stuff on here every now and then. And I literally, I literally did nothing for this channel for like a really long time. So all the subscribers that I have right now are, are old subscribers. They're guaranteed not around anymore. And it's been dormant for a very long time. And I was like, my original idea was to, to go out and start doing it again like like as in like uh just start over have a new youtube channel yada 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 and i thought about it, I was like that's what i do every time i go out get a new youtube channel start posting becoming consistent and then it just sits there and dies so i'm like i don't want to do that i mean just use a channel i already have i'm gonna use the biggest one i got which is this one right here and it's just post like it's already going to do bad anyways just post just post the videos and I don't want to use it. I don't want to use any like uh, any music, any like I got, bro, I got sound effects. I got an editing program. I got a whole setup at my house so where I can make these videos pop. But I was like, I, I, if it's too hard, cause I, I work a lot. Like I work a lot out here, bro. Like a lot. So if it's too, like, if it takes too much time to sit there and edit and do all these things, I can't just do it really quick. I'm, I'm going to become inconsistent because I don't have time to sit at my house for two to three hours at a computer to drop all the cool titles and all these things in there. I don't have time to do that, unfortunately. But what I do, do have time for is to set up a camera like I have right now and be able to talk to the camera and say, yo, boom, 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 this is what's on my mind, whatever. And who influenced me to even start this, which I thank you so much for you because, like, bro... As you, uh, Jeremy, as you just said, I came into your life at, at a perfect moment, which is divine intervention, which I truly believe in. The same thing happened with someone that, bro, their channel is named, I'm, I'm just going to put it right here. So their channel is named DoDash. So obviously she does DoorDash and she, you know, that's the type of content that she makes, I'm, I'm assuming before, because what the video I came across was like a video, like you ever watch, seen like a thumbnails, like it's just a person sitting in a car. So I'm, I'm thinking like, eh, I'm not really gonna get anything from this, but I just let it play anyways. That's kind of how it was. I let it play and just her message, I was like, wow, that's such a powerful message. And it really affected me in a, in a, in a positive way. So I was like, you know what? I even left a comment, I was like, yo, I expected to get nothing from your video. I expected to just just watch another video like I've been watching videos all day anyways. I really appreciate you and you've inspired me to just get out there and, and do it. You know, just just feels like that, that Shia LeBeau moment. Just do it! You know, like one of those moments. But And I was like, I'm just going to post. It doesn't matter how it goes. Who cares how many views I get? Who cares if... I'm going to post and I'm going to put my message out there and someone's going to hear it. And surprisingly, they're not all sitting at zero. Because <laughs> I expected my videos to be like at zero, five, six views maybe. But like, I was like, man, because like, I don't have real subscribers on here because like I said, like, I, I've had this channel for so long and I literally have done nothing with it, you know, and, and, and your subscribers are not just sitting there waiting for you to post. Your subscribers have moved on to other things that they're subscribed to. They may catch you back on the rebound like, oh, wow, who, uh, 
He looks familiar. Oh, that's, oh, wow. Okay, this is what he's doing now. And they might unsubscribe because they didn't come here for that. I, I started posting prank content. That was my, my thing. I posted nothing but prank content and I would post like one to five videos. And the only reason why I even have this many subscribers is because of TikTok. So at that time, back then, I would have video, videos go super viral. And those people would just filter in from there to your YouTube and start subscribing. So you could have like, in 2018, 2019, you could have built your YouTube to a superior status if you just continually went viral. This is without saying, hey guys, check out my YouTube, click the link, check out my YouTube, without even saying that. People would just see your page, like your last video, jump over to whatever link you had, which at that time was YouTube, and then they would just subscribe. Then I thought the same thing might work with Instagram, but it doesn't. It doesn't work the same way with Instagram at all. It just sits there. But everybody started flooding over to over to YouTube, and I started getting subscribers. Videos started uh, doing well. Every time I posted a video, you have people from TikTok. They'd be like, hey, who was here from TikTok, and yada, yada, yada. And that was cool. That was fun. That was awesome, you know? And now it's like... TikTok is like, we're like still like in this TikTok metrodome that they're like, we don't want to have, if you have a link in your bio, we're suppressing your videos. If we, if you have all these things right here, you're telling people to go follow your YouTube, we're, we're suppressing the videos. They want you so, they, they are so desperate to keep you inside of this TikTok dome that they built. It's like this big trap, this huge trap that everything was good, everything was great, and it just started slowly closing in and closing in until now we like this, and we want to hold you at that exact level. Now people are like, boom, they're just jumping out and going off to other places. Like, without TikTok doing that to me, honestly, I would be doing this same thing right here on TikTok, but now I'm like, they've messed everything up so bad there that they don't deserve my content. I never gave YouTube a fair shake, and YouTube has been here longer than any other platform. When they say, hey, we went viral, that came from YouTube. That term came from YouTube. You went viral on YouTube, bro. So I'm like, dang, bro. So this really, this is really something cool that I could start doing and take serious and have a long path ahead of me. Because it's been here for the last two, three decades already, right? It's already been, well, I don't know about three, but it's definitely been here for the past two decades. And people have been here for so long that they went a full circle back into whatever they're doing, you know? Like, there's not a lot of creators. Like, when I think about, like, who's been here really long and still doing it, like, there's only a handful of creators that have found super success from YouTube and are still doing it. Maybe not every day, but I'm saying just at least still doing it. And they're not doing, a lot of times they're not doing what they started with because, you know, the subscribers get bored and they, you know, they don't want to, these people to start disappearing. You got to revamp stuff every now and then, you know. And what, what's happening with right now with this is having a car and just filming your videos, I don't, I have time. I don't have I don't have I don't have a lot of time, but I have time to just do this. I would preferably I would like to go to my recording studio at my house and record these videos. But I'm when I wake up, I'm so like in a rush. I got to get my lunch. I got to get my coffee. I got to get like my things, everything together. I got to kiss my wife. I got to kiss my son. All right, guys, have a good one. Boom, my daddy be back. Things like that. Like I got so much stuff to do that by the time I'm here, like, all right, cool, I am in the middle of working right now, but I have some free time in the middle of working in the second transitional period, so I'm able to just make these videos, and I can edit them, it takes about 10, 15 minutes, and everything is posted and scheduled, I have that amount of time, I could post three, four, five times a day if I really wanted to, but I don't want to overwhelm you with too many videos, I just want to make sure that you know that this video is your video, I'm responding to your comment, because your comment to me meant something and I was like wow that's cool like that someone else is having this moment with me right now that I had with someone else that has she has like 7,000 followers uh, over subscribers over there at YouTube I'm not YouTube but on her on her channel and I have 500 and I've able been able to reach somebody 
on the video that has what like I think like 20 views on it you know what I'm saying <laughs> like that's crazy of 20 people who watched that one person already got got affected from it so I feel like I'm on the right path and I really want to continue down this path I want to be able to respond to your comments with videos and maybe one day I'll have to respond to like five six seven eight nine ten comments in a video and that, that'll be the video of me responding to each comments directly because I, I want to make sure that you understand that I appreciate you being here. I appreciate you like even watching the video. Like, bro, it's a 15-minute video. Not everybody's prepared to watch a 15-minute video of literally someone sitting in their car and talking. But I feel like we're just so distracted with so many other entertaining things that it's kind of like, a breath of fresh air to be able to like listen to somebody and almost feel like you're in the room with them or in the car with them wherever they're at to be able to have this kind of conversation and be like wow okay whoa boom and get your mind kind of rolling you're like wow like you start thinking about it you're like bro but and you start talking to yourself about it and you're like these are new ideas that you would have never had had you not watched this video that video whatever video you watched and that's why I watch these videos too. Like I, these videos that I'm making, I, I literally am a fan of these types of videos. And what's funny is I like, there's a weird thing where I'm like a fan of the mundane. It's so hard to understand, but like I'm a fan of the mundane. So my, my, for anyone who doesn't know what mundane is, mundane is like things that are just like, like kind of like what you call boring content ultimately it's, like, it's like kind of like boring it's like almost so boring that it's almost entertaining to watch it's kind of like what it mundane is is it's like it's mundane it's like boring but it's just just entertaining enough for me to want to tune in and listen to the rest of the message or listen to the rest of what they have to say because people have different perspectives man and sometimes when you watch a video it's not just for your entertainment because it's, it's sometimes it is God, intervention, uh, divine intervention, uh, actual outside, outside being that's pushing you into that direction to think a certain way. And sometimes you think about something, you just need the answer. And then you watch someone's video and be like, that's confirmation right there, bro. I'm in the right way. I'm doing the right thing. Boom, boom, boom. That, and that's what that comment did for me is I, it confirms that I'm doing what I'm supposed to be doing. You see what I'm saying? And maybe the video that that person watched from me was confirmation to, to say that, yeah, I'm in the right doing what I'm needing to do. And I'm glad I seen that guy's video and boom. Because that's a, that's a long comment. You don't like write a long comment like that if it didn't affect you in some way. You know what I'm saying? So I appreciate you guys. Like I said, if you leave comments. I will definitely respond to you with the video. I don't respond in the actual comment section. And the reason why I don't do that is because I don't want people to get scammed out there with these tele fake telegram people. I don't know if they're still around. I just don't want that to happen to you. So just know that I'm only going to respond to you through a video if I do respond to your comments. But I do appreciate every single one of you guys commenting, liking, sharing, doing whatever you're doing. I'm not going to sit there and go to down this corny hole of like, make sure you guys are subscribed, man. Hit that like, hit that blah, 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 blah. Like, bro, like, if you've got something from this, you're going to subscribe. If you truly like what you see, you're going to like. And if you truly want to have that conversation, you're going to comment. And that's how I'm going to leave it. All right. Peace.